Me and Christy actually went and drove a Tesla. They are pretty, pretty cool cars. So here's what I've learned about them. Yo. Yeah, we were starting to wonder about you. Was... Sorry, guys. I actually took a call and hung up of at like 9:32, but then it took me like five minutes to find the Mahoney Manhart, like the the teams thing, to like get everybody on. I couldn't find it. Got another got another one from the my dude Keith down here. Okay, man. Twenty twenty one year old roof. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. All right, last week, Blake crushing it again. <laughs> 40, 47, Blake coming in at 14 for the month. That's solid, dude. Karen, good on the package rate, 50%. April overall, 44, that's good. That's sweet there. Guess we gotta we gotta step up our game, huh, Blake? What was what was mine? Yeah. <laughs> That's right, man. Um All right, Karen, good job on the visits. 145. That's sweet. I like that. Cool. That is very good. There's nothing inside of me that says if you don't keep doing that that things are not going to change and your revenue doesn't double in the next handful of months here. PPNA 1.33, that's good. 1.45 for the for April. Last week we actually did pretty good revenue wise. It seemed like that third week was dead, huh, Blake? Well, it was. I mean, it was down. It's probably it was probably down 40% from what we kind of established as a normal week. Yeah, Karen and Jake, you guys had new highs for April. P PRs, personal. Yeah. PRs, that's right. That's awesome, man. Good, good stuff. Okay, guys. Monday morning meeting in the books. We finished out April pretty well. That one week, I believe we were about forty percent down on on lead flow and revenue. So to end the month with a strong week feels pretty good. Jake and Karen had personal best in April, so not all bad, you know. I kind of like what Blake put out for the uh, the inspiration this week of kind of the metaphor of planting seeds and harvesting them and basically, you know, to dive deeper into our relationships rather than, than wider goes a long ways for us. We've noticed that over the years that although in the beginning we casted a pretty wide net, that the folks we do business with now, the number of those folks is a lot smaller because I think we have become good friends with a lot of these people over the last four years. And uh, we have a good working relationship with them. We take care of their clients. We've delivered on everything we've told them to, that we would. And uh, those relationships have just flourished a lot a lot more than the others so I do think Blake brings up a good point in that you know some of the ones that kind of are maybe on the fringes that we didn't do as good of a job connecting with or maybe staying in front of consistently those have kind of uh, left us but at the same time I think we got to do a better job of uh, keeping those people on the fringe so when we hire people like Jake and Karen we can have them prospect those people 
and try to form maybe a deeper relationship that better than what uh, me and Blake were able to do. So text me guys, say hello, 704-285-0992. Let me know what you're doing out there, what's working. Let me know how I can help. If you're enjoying these, subscribe to our channel. It would mean the world to us. We're hoping to bring you guys some value out there around insurance and just uh, what we do on a daily basis here. So let me know what you think of the vlog so far. We've got a ton of footage in the in the bank. So that makes me feel good. And um, we're, we've been rolling these out on a consistent basis. So I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget, send me a text message and we'll, uh, we'll see you guys soon. All right, what's up guys? So a little update today. Me and Christy actually went and drove a Tesla. They are pretty, pretty cool cars. So here's what I've learned about them is that they basically have zero maintenance. The guy told me that all you have to do is rotate your tires and uh, put in uh, windshield wipe, wiper fluid and then um, change the, the wipers every now and again. So pretty cool. The other thing that I learned diving deep into this over the last probably four days is that rather than looking for gas stations, you have to look for the super charging stations out there. So I know for me, as I was looking at it, I kind of would have a lot of hesitation and maybe even some anxiety around the fact that if we drove that thing from here to North Carolina, it would definitely, definitely create a new awareness and path that we may have to take depending on where those charging stations are. There's a lot more of them out there than I ever thought. So do you have a Tesla? If so, I'd love to hear about it. Text me 704-285-0992. The good, the bad, the ugly, whatever your thoughts are. I think they're pretty cool. At the end of the day, it's we drove the Model Y. It's way, way too small for our family of six. We'd be lucky to maybe fit a couple suitcases in the back. So definitely does not work out for us yet. They do have that Model X, which is a little bit out of our budget. I don't know if I could bring myself to spend that much on a car right now at least. But uh, anyways, what do you think of the Teslas? They're pretty cool. I That's what I think. Do you have one? Let me know. I'd love to hear from you. As far as the insurance goes, we do insure a bunch of Teslas already. I don't see a significant you know, increase in, uh, in those auto policies. So nothing to report there. Um, on another note, I reshopped a existing client of mine. We had to separate out some of the, uh, stuff that was on the home policy, meaning like the jewelry and golf cart because the home policy skyrocketed. So we separated those out to a handful of different companies, ended up saving them like 700 bucks a year. Um, just kind of another benefit as to why we work with all of these different companies. And uh, you start to see that the same company who was competitive three to five years ago are not the same ones that are competitive now. So being able to keep our clients at the best rates possible and keep their business here is a huge, huge benefit to our model. Um, hope you guys are doing well. It's getting hot here in Florida, so you will start to see an increased amount of video with me and my tank tops. Just selling insurance all day. All right, guys. <laughs> See ya. Have a good day, night, evening, morning, wherever you're watching this. Don't forget to subscribe. I hope you're enjoying it. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. Subscribe. Uh, let me know your thoughts. We'd love to hear it. See ya. Thank you.